So here we are in Cree, West Yorkshire, outside the hotel this morning. Eight of us have ridden up to Yorkshire with the plan to ride the Yorkshire Dales up into the Pennines and then further up into the Northumberland National Park and the Kilda Forest today. So we've got our bikes lined up here. We've got Collins GS and we've got John's 1190 KTM. We've got my beautiful bike, Red GS. And here's the pretty one of the bunch, Simon's Ducati Pikes Peak Multistrada. Here's Matt's bike, uh, KTM 1290 Adventure S and Rich Collins on his uh, KTM Super Duke, uh, no screen on that, <laughs> good luck. And we have here Shep with his new Yamaha MT-10, the only non-V-twin amongst them. And finally Chris on his KTM Super Duke GT. So uh, we hope we're going to have a sunny day today and after breakfast have a great ride uh, through a mix of nice scenery and fast roads. Here we go. So here we go and the plan today is to do a 300 mile loop up through the Yorkshire Dales into the North Pennines and then hopefully up into the Kilda Forest and I'm planning to do the uh, Kilda Forest Drive through Kilda Forest. So, we'll catch you later. Well, this is the Yorkshire Dales. Right on the top. But I rode this the, the, near the top of the Yorkshire Dales at the moment. Look at that, fantastic. Been in the Alps. was Rich Collins whizzing past me because I took my hand off the throttle to wipe a fly off my visor. I tell you, you can't relax for a minute here. <laughs> Thank you. 
We're well, trying to find some coffee. Yeah. No so coffee. Not allowed to have motorbikes. Not allowed to have motorbikes. No motorbikes. No motorbikes. Fucking hell. <laughs> well, apparently we can't get coffee. <laughs> Because the motorbikes are not allowed at this particular place. Wonderful. So I was sitting at the back um, watching what was going on and my sat nav said turn left and I noticed that most of those in front were signalling to turn left but Matt decided to turn right so we all followed and um, it wasn't a surprise when just up the road we all had to turn round. But uh, let's just put it down to a sat nav moment and uh, these things happen to the best of us when leading. So now hopefully we're on the right road and we're heading for some really great fast roads in the North Pennines uh, across the open moors. Hey, bring it on.
my GS range of around 230 miles. This new MT-10 has a small tank and it drinks fuel. So at about 100 miles he's beginning to get worried as there's not too many pet stations up here on the moors. So I think it's time we went and found one. <laughs> towards the Kilda Forest and uh, we caught up eight very slow bikers um, being led by a guy on a chopper and another on a trike. We waved as we passed them. Well, it's, it's like this, boys. The forest drive runs west to east, but you can do it either way. Now, I've just made a turn that puts us on the west side, which is wrong. So we need to turn around and ride it east to west as planned. So here we are at the start of the 12 mile track through Kilda Forest, uh, it's just Matt on his KTM 1290 and Colin and me on our GSs. The others have taken the road up to Scotland and we'll meet them at Kilda Castle on the other side of the forest. So let's go for it.
now at the end of the 12 mile trail there is actually a charge of three pounds to ride it uh, as we rode in the machine on our side said pay on the other side so uh, being honest guys we uh, went back to try and pay and but the other side said out of order so we did try so now you know we mid afternoon time to head back to the uh, hotel in Ilkley and um, try and meet up with the others um, we're talking about 160 miles to go uh, and hopefully by the time we get there um, all that dust may even have blown off Colin's jacket Well, what a great day's riding. 300 miles on some great roads and a curry to finish off tonight. Fantastic. So subscribe to this channel and also make sure to visit my blog where you can get the full written coverage and also catch up on some of my past adventures. So thanks for stopping by.